What's up guys and we're back with this news and we're just few weeks away from the official launch of the Samsung Galaxy S22 series and we just got our biggest and the most important information about the Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra. We know that from last few years Samsung have been trying very hard to reach the performance of Snapdragon's processor but every time when Samsung releases a smartphone and we compare Snapdragon variant with the Exynos processor we see a huge margin in the performance of Exynos and Snapdragon processor. No matter if we talk about CPU or GPU performance Snapdragon processor is always ahead as compared to Exynos processor. And this time we heard that Samsung is going to use AMD architecture in the Exynos processor which is going to perform as fast as Snapdragon processor and we also see a teaser from Samsung about the release date of the Exynos 2200 processor which was about to take place on 11 January. And for some reason Samsung deleted every teaser regarding that processor release date even on their Twitter account and YouTube channel. And now we are hearing that Samsung just cancelled the Exynos processor and no matter in which country you live, no matter in which region you live, you are going to get Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 processor which is a good news as well as bad news. Now we are not going to see Exynos processor which was Samsung's custom made processor in the Samsung mobile phone but the good news is that the most powerful and the most efficient processor will be available in every region. Which means that no matter in which country you live you are not going to get more or less performance as compared to other countries like we have seen in previous years. But take this news as a grain of salt because we are also hearing that Samsung may release the Exynos 2200 processor alongside with the Samsung Galaxy S22 series which is highly unlikely because we have never seen this happening before. Honestly speaking, I am going to be very happy if Samsung really brings Snapdragon variant all over the world because every time we have seen Snapdragon variant of Samsung Galaxy series perform higher as compared to Exynos series. And thanks to the ice universe, now we also know that the Gorilla Glass that Samsung is going to use in the Samsung Galaxy S22 series is going to be Gorilla Glass Victus Plus. Gorilla Glass Victus was released previous year which we have already seen in many smartphones of 2021 and Gorilla Glass Victus Plus is supposed to be 14% more stronger as compared to Gorilla Glass Victus. We already know that Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra is going to come with the design of the Samsung Galaxy Note 20 Ultra design with the same square design and the same built-in S Pen support. And now it's going to be even more durable glass. We also got some of the display information of the Samsung Galaxy S22 series, the base model, which is going to be Samsung Galaxy S22 and S22 Plus, is going to have a peak brightness of 1500 nits. And by breaking all the records, Galaxy S22 Ultra is going to have 1700 nits of peak brightness, which is going to be the first ever in smartphone. So using the smartphone in sunny day or watching HDR content is going to give you one of the best experience you ever had. Now we know that from the specification list that got leaked few days ago of the Galaxy S22 series, Galaxy S22 Ultra is going to come in 4 different colors which are going to be phantom black, phantom white, green and burgundy color. And Galaxy S22 slash S22 plus is going to come in phantom black, phantom white, green and pink color. And according to Ice Universe, people who have seen Galaxy S22 and S22 plus mostly choose to like white and pink color. And for the Galaxy S22 Ultra, they choose white and green color. And green color is also my favorite color, so this time, I'm very happy Samsung chose to bring green color. So let me know what you think about these devices in the comment section below. And if you're new to the channel, make sure to hit the subscribe button and turn notifications. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.